What's going on YouTube? Sorry from Mbucket TV here today to bring a review video on a product from the company Olympus. Not only do they make digital cameras, but they also make recorders as well. And today we'll be reviewing the LS-20M HD Linear PCM Recorder. So what I'm gonna do right now, I took everything out the box already, so I'm just gonna show you what comes inside the box. So now what comes inside of the box is the recorder itself, a rechargeable lithium ion battery, USB transfer cable, and the wall adapter. So now let's talk about the LS20M. Now you can see on the front you have two LCD screens. So this one is the main screen, this one is the subscreen. We'll get to those in just a second. Right below that you have the stop button, the record button, and around the record button, you'll see it looks white right now, but it also lights up red when the device is recording. You have a directional pad with a uh, middle button, so that's for entering um, different menu functions, as well as a different array of buttons on the bottom. Now when we turn the device to one side, what you have here is the power button, so you pull it and hold it to turn the device on or push it up to hold it. You also have a remote um, jack, so you can buy a optional external remote to go with this thing. You also have the earphone jack, you plug your earphones in, and you have the microphone jack. Now people are probably saying, well, why do you need a microphone on a digital recorder? Let's just say you want to put it like under your shirt and have the shirt clip mic, leave this device in your pocket and record that way. At the top here, you have a left and right microphone as well as an LED peak indicator up top. On this side, you have another switch. And this helps you switch in between video and voice. So this one is voice, you switch it over, and that's video recording. Now, right here you have an SDHC card slot. You just pop it open, put the SD card in, close it up. On the bottom, you have the battery bay. You just push the button to the side, take it off. There's that uh, rechargeable lithium ion battery, as well as a tripod uh, screw and an external microphone. And if you look right here in the front, you have a video camera. And this does 1080p, 30 frames per second video. So now let's power the device on. All right, so right now I have it in video mode. And what you'll see here up top is the different video files that I took. And what we're gonna do right now is get to the video quality test really quickly and show you some of the video that I took with this device. The M Bucket TV private jet 1080p video test, you know what I'm saying? That's how we do M Bucket TV. So, those are just some really quick video clips that I took with this device when I was outside. Now, you can also do video playback on the device itself. You just select which file you want to play back. And there it is. This was a clip that I took while I was in the train station waiting for the train the other day. But on the back, the speaker, you can hear it playing the sound. Now, the speaker on the back is not the loudest, but if you're indoors, you can kind of hear what you uh, recorded. If you're outdoors or at a concert, you won't hear what you recorded because of all the wind and outside noise. All right. Now, you can also, let's just show you when I hit the record button, you'll see the screen just so you see that. It has a nice LCD screen. I'm moving my hand live. Elijah's football in the background there. Um, below that, the secondary LCD screen, you'll have your elapsed time and things like that. Above it, you'll have the total time left on your uh, SD memory card. Over here on the side, you'll have the battery indicator. And right here where it looks like a little circle square, that means it's stopped. When you hit record, it'll change or you pause it, it'll change as well to indicate what you're doing. Now when we go into the audio file mode, same thing. You have the left and the right microphones at the top. This thing does really great audio recording. I'm not going to play it back for you right now because um, it's great. But the main focus of this video is for the video quality. But the audio, fo the audio on this device is awesome. I do recommend trying to find some kind of windsock to cover the front when you are outside. And now all the same features are on the audio side as the video side. You have your different folder files here. You have almost the same exact functions on a secondary LCD screen. Now on the bottom of this device, when we open it up, you have a mini USB and a micro HDMI port. Now, you can also use this device as a webcam. So you can stream live if you're using like Ustream or any kind of a 
live stream site, you can use this as well. That's a really cool feature. This thing does three things. It records outside video, it records the audio, and it does a webcam. So already right there, you're getting three devices in one. Now you're asking yourself, well, Sonny, how much will this device run me? This will cost you $249.99 on Olympus's website. Now, ask yourself, you're like, oh man, $249? Well, you get a digital audio recorder, you get a video recorder on the go, and you get a webcam. So that's three devices. Even if each were $100, that'd be $300. This is $249.99. Now, if you're a professional and you're really trying to get something that's on professional level, I don't recommend this device. They do have a higher model than this. It costs about $400. Definitely check that one out on Olympus's website. But for the uh, average user or musician or something like that, this model will do fine. I definitely say go out, check it out, definitely give it a try. Well, this has been Sonny from M Bucket TV. Make sure before you go, you like this video, like a little thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and leave a comment down below and share this video with your friends. And as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos.